I'm Eric Luskin from American Public Television. In June 2013, I had a chance to speak with Doc Martin's executive producer, Mark Crowdy, at the production office on a farm not far from Port Isaac in Cornwall. Mark describes the evolution of Doc Martin and the serendipity that brought the film's original director to work with the team on Series 6. In 1999, 1999, I made a film down here in Cornwall called Saving Grace. Um, and uh, I'm from this area, so um, yeah, so born and brought up down here. Uh, we made Saving Grace. Um, Nigel Cole, the director of Saving Grace, uh, brought in Martin Clunes. He knew Martin for some time, so Martin came in and played the character of Dr. Martin Bamford. And um, we had a great time together. We really enjoyed each other's company. Uh, the film did well. Sky, who were uh, one of the financiers, of Saving Grace uh, approached us and said, you know, would we be interested in making some uh, made-for-TV movies based on Martin's character, which we thought was a great idea. So we took his character, developed that up, and we made two made-for-TV movies. The idea was that we were going to do a six, or we were going to do two a year for three years. And uh, so we did the first two, and uh, again, we had a great time together, uh, but Sky decided not to finance movies anymore. Martin went over and met with ITV, with Philippa, his wife, um, and uh, we produced the two Doc Martin movies together, myself and Philippa, um, and we took them over to ITV. ITV loved the idea of the whole thing, they loved the name, they wanted the whole, they wanted the whole thing, but they wanted another character. They wanted a different character, they didn't want the same one that Martin played. So. Um, we, I remember this very well, um, myself, Ben Bolt, the original director, and Philippa, sitting in the Soho House Hotel, and we had a very, very short window, a couple of hours, to come up with the idea, because otherwise Martin was going to have to go off and do something else, and we had this window to do it. And luckily I managed to come up with this idea of a, a surgeon who couldn't stand the smell of blood and burning flesh. And we took that which Martin immediately liked the idea of that uh, uh, for the kernel of a character. And we took that and developed that up with Dominic Minghella, the original series writer. And um, the rest, as they say, is history, I guess. And, um, but it's, it's kind of nice where we are now on this sixth season um, that we're doing now, because um, Nigel Cole, when I originally met him for, to come on as a director for Saving Grace, one of the first things he did was he showed me a photograph of himself as a young boy, about five, seven years old, on the beach at Port Isaac. And he'd come here for holidays, right? And so he knew it very well. And last summer, in 2012, I was down here, and uh, I got a phone call from Nigel and saying, oh, I'm in Port Isaac, you know, are you around? And I was. And it was at that point that Ben Bolter decided he'd wanted to move on and do something else. And I said, oh, Nigel, how funny that you're here. Why don't you come over and talk? And so we had a lovely chat, and um, we proposed the idea that he did this season. Doc Martin is broadcast in the U.S. on public television. Check your local listings. Doc Martin DVDs are available at retail.